Hey guys, welcome to Snowbreak Containment Zone. We do have a little bit of an update on the buffs for Agave. So this is from Chong Chong. Uh, this is from the Billy Billy page. So hello everyone. Optimization of tequila, which is Agave, is still in progress. So they're still working on it. They're not saying what it is at this point. Since the field optimization requires repeated adjustments and testing so it's more of i think they're testing how everything is going to feel when you do especially i think the the standard skill right now for me it's a bit it's a little bit sluggish for me it's it doesn't have any pace you do you also have to maintain a certain um you know a certain rhythm to attain phase four and to maintain phase four even if you don't have a target so i hope they're going to tweak it a little bit so it takes a long time we will complete the optimization work as soon as possible please wait patiently so this happened september 4th 2024 so that was yesterday okay let us break down the possibilities of this uh the, the, the this buff so either either they're gonna be tweaking the existing buff meaning they're just going to be changing a little bit of the values or completely <laughs> or not completely partially redo her kit okay i don't see a, a a complete rework but it's either tweaking the values of the existing skills or they're going to be partially redoing the kit okay so with that in mind let us go through some of the things that i think will be changed let us look for agavir so okay so let's uh, take a look at her skills for her standard skill there are two things that i am actually looking at that they could tweak okay so right now the phases um should be maintained um within two seconds if not it res it resets to phase zero so the two seconds there really is very very quick i've noticed that what if you don't have any enemies in between you're actually just forced to shoot and shoot without any enemies and it consumes your s energy which i think should be changed to at most three to minimum t o two three to number three from two to three that is what i mean so with that said that would probably increase your waiting time for the next opponent to come out um and would give you more leeway uh, leeway in terms of maintaining it in phase four if you're in phase four already okay number two is uh in terms of um the standard scale probably have a damage buff for phase uh, phase four right now phase four is just um attack plus 56 you don't really need to increase phases one two and three so this is uh three forty percent at at now this has room for growth because every player's um objective for her is going to be maintaining at phase four so either you increase the duration before it resets to zero or you increase the damage of phase four or you can do both okay so you get my drift there so for standard skill those are i think the things that they could tweak this is this is a tweak by the way and the other one is going to be in the ultimate skill the ultimate skill um is going to be it's going to be two parts one part is going to be the stack so right now it's going to be max of 100 stacks so either they could decrease this probably to 80 or increase the personal flare damage percentage from 40 percent i think it's 40 right now so probably increase it from 40 up probably up to 50 60 or 
lower the stacks probably from 100 to 80 or to 70 or they could do both again so this will actually tie up to your standard skill because you're going to be the the ultimate you know the ultimate um energy regen is not going to be a problem it's more of having the desired you know damage attaining it you have to go to 100 now but if you shorten that or you increase the damage it would be worth our while or you could do both so those are the things that i think is you know is important um s energy however is also tied to this so she doesn't gain s energy while she's in combat she only gains she regens s uh, regenerates s energy uh, when she's not in combat, when she's running from one combat scene to another, then she regens there. She can re regen um, as well when you are shooting your pistol. But again, we'd like to do that less frequently. So I hope that they could put another mechanic for S regen. Um, I'm not sure what, but those are the things that I think, um, you know, I think is, is doable. So for now... Um, I'm not gonna do a ultimate build guide for this girl because we don't know yet what the final product of Vidya is going to be. We do have um, probably a week to wait for that or before the next update is going to be out. But for now, I'm going to be holding off on my ultimate guide since um we don't know since i learned that they're planning to do it now they confirm that they're gonna do it or they're testing her i'm not gonna do it plus the tier list will have to wait because again i need more data on her once her um her new buffs come out whether it's good or not whether whether it's sufficient or not so right now um if you want my opinion on her she is she is up there she is above average really um in terms of dps not really she's decent in mobs but not really with in terms of uh, a large number of mobs um especially if mobs come out sparingly like they have a larger distance from each other it's not gonna be it's not really gonna work um she's actually better with um, with bosses especially with multi-part bosses so because again phase four right now is really really difficult to maintain it's a challenge really playing her at this point okay so again those are my thoughts but by the way guys i'd like to leave you with something else so we have here um the banner for cherno this is actually a banner for either Cherno or Enya. It's not a banner for Cherno. So I chose Cherno even though I'm not going to be pulling for her. But you can, you know, transfer from Cherno to Enya. But let's do select uh, Cherno here. And the weapon as well is either for Cherno or for Enya. So again, if you're asking me who is the best to summon here, Cherno so far is one of the best DPS, skill DPS characters or ops that we have so please do get her please do get her weapon as well um i'm not i'm not sure if when is the next go around here but if you're done with vidya right now she is the best to get even before the next banner because i'm not sure when her next her next banner is gonna come you know gonna gonna come around so with that said hopefully you do have good pulls here i'm not pulling for her anymore i have my cherno I have already have Cherno at uh, M3. I just got her to M3. Um, I'm just going to be farming for her, you know, for her copies in, you know, in uh, as shards. I'm not going to be pulling. I'm going to be saving for the next banner, whoever it is. I'm not sure if it's going to be Nita. For those who didn't pull for Enya uh, or did it's not pull, for those who didn't get Enya, as a free character a few months ago, um, I'm really sorry. Um, uh, it was just a very limited time. I think for every free character, they're going to be giving out two in a year. So hopefully you could have or you could get the next one. I hope that you got Fanny Starshine as a free character. This girl over here. 
So the next free character probably will come in uh, one year and six months anniversary. Usually they do that in you know in that span. So one point one point five or one year six months anniversary and the two year anniversary. So hopefully guys you can get the free character. But for now Enya and Cherno is going to be available as a rate up banner. Again, feel free to choose from either both, but I would suggest you get Cherno. So hopefully we could get also updates from the, the buff of Vidya so that we could, you know, give you guys more information if Vidya is really worth the investment. Right now, there are a lot of, you know, operatives that could do what she does. She, she, she's not really that unique at this point, except for how she looks. So, so if, if if you're going for wife over meta, there's nothing wrong with it. But again, um, if you don't want to pull for her, it's not also a problem. We'll see after the buffs. If um, hopefully they give out the um, the buff, the buffs, the buff or buffs before this banner ends, because some of you guys might be waiting for that buff. So. That is it, guys. Comment in the comment section, and I hope to see you in the next video. Thank you guys for staying this far. Take care, stay safe. This is The Warden, and I'm out of here.